I am Urvisha Monogra from Keratitis Solution Private Limited. In previous video, we saw how we can inherit POS Widget in JavaScript and we taken one example of POS Load Serial Number pop-up. Uh, so, in this video, I will show you how we can call Python function from JavaScript. We take same example of Load Serial Number pop-up that we take in previous video and uh, on Click on OK button, I will show you one alert with POS current session name. That current session name we will get from Python method and display in uh, JavaScript. Uh, let's start how we can do this. So, uh, here we need to first inherit POS pop-up widget. So, in previous video we already inherited this widget. So, we use the same widget and uh, call python method in this widget. So, let's start how we can call python method. So, uh, for that we need to inherit RPC. So, where RPC required web.rpc. Using this RPC, we can call python method. Uh, let's inherit here uh, RPC dot query. And we have some argument for query like model. Model is our object name from which model we want to call method. So here I want to call method from POS order object. So I add model name of POS order then after method. So this is our name of method. I want to get current session name. So I give name like get current session name. And third one is argument. So, ARGS and pass argument here. Uh, I add one argument like QS session ID and using this session ID, I get name of current session. So, I add argument like this dot options dot order dot QS session ID. This will be an integer QS session ID. Uh, so, first we create this method in Python file. So, I have Python file that inherited with POS order object. Let's define one method, method name and argument. Argument is POS session ID. Using this POS session ID argument, you browse POS session record. So, Define one variable like PS session and browse variable self dot PNV PS session object name and after browse method and argument PS session ID and after return name of PS session so I pass PS session dot name this will return the character string argument express session name and we use this uh, method here uh, this is for call our method and if you want to use uh, argument that is written by uh, pos method then we need to add here one then function then function and argument uh, i pass one argument result so this result is take value that is written by python method so let's see, now I add one alert and uh, one message POS session name and the result that is returned by Python method result. Okay. Now our uh, Python method is called. So let's see how it, it will work. So restart server. And check the result. Okay. Now, this is load serial number pop up. It load serial number and click on OK button. That type it will display one alert with current POS session name. So, like this, we can inherit, uh, we can call Python method from Chargebit. Okay, thank you.